using Paloise Connect, after you've installed Paloise Connect at your command line, run the command Paloise Connect. You'll be greeted by a login screen. We'll produce a, a login and a password for you. If you don't have a password or you've installed this without an account, you can use the uh, sign up button, which will instigate an email to us. If you've forgotten your password, similarly click the forgot password. Once you're logged in, you'll be greeted by an interface. This interface is not docked in your application, allowing you to pull it over to a second screen while not in use um, or clearing up your screen space. The usage is simple. Uh, just grab the components that you want. In this instance, this ring we're going to produce in two parts, the head and the shank. So I'm going to grab all the head components. You will notice that it will automatically not select the stones. Click on add part. You'll be greeted by an orange preview. What the application has done is in the back end, it has booleaned everything. It has created a uniform mesh, which allows a very accurate weight estimation for the tool and also the best print quality of oak that we can produce. So then press enter to add the part into the tool. You'll see that it captures an image. This image will track on our job packet for you. You can select an alloy. Uh, let's in this case pick 10 karat white gold and you have a quantity of one. The manufacturing fee, which is both the print fee and the cast fee, is represented in the field manufacturing fee, the weight of the alloy, the alloy price per, uh, for this item, and then the total cost. Then similarly, we can do the uh, we can do the shank. So we're gonna grab the shank component, all these guys, and we're gonna pop it in there. The measure can be tweaked on your command line. If you feel that it's too smoothed or you prefer a little more resolution, you can play with the details on the, on the command line. We'll do a separate video on exactly what those do. Generally speaking, just press enter. Okay, and then you can put that in 10 white. And then the same as above, you have a manufacturing fee, a weight to the part, an alloy price, and then a total cost. You can add up to six parts in any one job. Uh, when you're happy, you can click on order. You can review an order summary. You're able to leave us a reference. The reference will be the main ticket that gets returned to you, the main bag with the entirety of the parts inside of it. So if this were for a customer of yours, Mrs. Jones, that would actually be printed on the, on the main ticket. These little comment fields down the bottom are the part tickets. So if you're receiving these as separate parts, you may not want us to de-sprue or have a special instruction, uh, meal grain this part or, or, or something like that you're able to leave us a note that will actually print on the part ticket, ticket as it moves to our system and also be on the part ticket when it comes back to you in case it's a note you need for yourself. Um, so you can leave those specific notes inside there. This is your total alloy price for the whole job, the manufacturing fee and then the total AUD dollar value of the job in our system. You can click place order, you get one confirmation screen and then you'll get an upload screen. So the upload screen has produced for you a order number reference. You can click copy order number so you can paste it into uh, any, any way you want to track the order number. Um, in our V2 pass beta you will also receive the, the, the confirmation by email. At this point you can close this window, you're done with this job.